Welcome back to Empowerment Nursing. I'm Linda and I'm a nurse educator. You are tuning in to our weekly application of In the Know where we make it simple. Please comment your response below and then play the video for the correct answer and rationale. Here's our question for this week. The, nurses, the nurse on a medicine floor is assessing a patient admitted with peripheral vascular disease who has an arterial occlusion. Which of the following statements by the patient should the nurse respond to immediately? So which one of the four really stands out as, uh-oh, that's not good? Okay, so what do you know about peripheral vascular disease? We know that it's a circulation problem, that it affects the limbs and the way that blood flows through the blood vessels. And in this case, the arteries and the peripheral circulation. So arterial disease is a problem with the blood getting down the arteries and the legs often as a result of atherosclerosis, so narrowing of those arteries in the legs, which of course could cause and often does cause pain. So here are the, the possibilities uh, for the answer. A, I am more comfortable when I sit with my legs hanging off the side of the bed. B, at home I use a heating pad on my legs because they are so cold. C, when I get up to go to the toilet, my legs start to hurt. And D, I notice that my legs don't have any hair anymore. Okay, so let's go back to A. I am more comfortable when I sit with my legs hanging off the side of the bed. This makes sense, doesn't it? Because with the legs hanging off the bed, it would increase the blood supply to the legs with the circulation of blood getting down there. So that would help decrease leg pain. So that makes sense. B, at home, I use a heating pad on my legs because they are so cold heating pad. Okay, you've got a situation where somebody's got decreased blood flow in their legs. So that means less circulation, less feeling in their legs. You put that together with this exam being a safety exam and a heating pad should be a red flag to you that this could cause burning on somebody's legs that they don't even feel that they're getting burns. So B actually is the correct answer. Uh, let's go back to C. When I get up to go to the toilet, my legs start to hurt. Again, this makes sense because somebody who has atherosclerosis in the arteries of their legs is going to have pain, kind of like angina in the legs when they get up to walk around. That's a normal symptom. And D, I notice that my legs don't have any hair anymore. Well, for hair to grow, you need oxygen. And when you don't have oxygenated blood getting down your legs, then hair is not going to grow. So that again is a normal finding. So this is the correct answer, B. At home, I use a heating pad on my legs because they are so cold. For the answer to this question and more, and for all concepts simplified for your registration exam, check out our complete study package. We guarantee you will pass or your money back. We'll see you next time. Bye for now.